I'm so excited for this update. Genuinely one of the best updates they've added. Oh my god. So hello gamers and welcome back to another video. So Phantom Forces is about to get the most important update in years. It's about to get keybinds and these keybinds are going to change the game bro i'm going to explain some of the best keybinds you can do here basically i'm copying over my battle bit settings because there's some stuff in battle bit that you could do that you can't do in this game that you now can actually do you can bind space to jump no vault and x to vault and then if you unbind your jump key look at this i am just jumping i don't have to vault and then if i hold x then I vault. But that means that you can actually just jump around in this map, in any map, and never accidentally vault again. And then if you want to vault, you can just hit the button. This is the most annoying feature in this game is that you'd randomly vault off of stuff all the time. Also, I'm pressing X and it's not making me super jump because I also rebound my dive key to Q because X used to be my super jump key. Let's look at some of the other binds though. You can also change your equipping weapons thing that could maybe help for equipping grenades. But the biggest problem right now that really is annoying to me is that i don't think you can bind it to mouse buttons which is really sad you can only bind it to left and right mouse button you can't bind it to mouse three or four which i really feel like you should be able to do wait p wait there's p to attack as well with the melee huh that's already a, a keybind. <laughs> another thing you can rebind though is if it's really hard to press g i'll just put it on f right now this with the q will make it way easier to super jump grenades you didn't know before it was kind of difficult to super jump and throw a grenade just with how the binds were laid out so you had to hold g and then you had to hit x and it, guys right now on your keyboard try to hit g and x while moving and <laughs> at the same time it's really hard and other than the fact that you can't use you know mouse three and four and if you have more buttons on your mouse you can't use them i think this is a perfect system because you used to be able to change your binds but you'd have to use a macro and then that would permanently make one key set to a different key until you turn off the macro again which was really annoying and not really worth using i'm so excited for this update genuinely one of the best updates they've added oh my gosh but yeah if you guys did enjoy make sure to like and subscribe if you're new but i'll see you guys in the next one peace have a nice day